Is my family at risk of developing myeloma? Many of the patients who come and see me, they will say, is, is my family at risk of developing myeloma? Are my sons and daughters going to have this? And the answer is, we don't know. We know that there is a higher risk of developing MGUS or myeloma in certain families. So there could be potentially some association, but we don't have an actual gene that we say, yes, this is inherited and this causes multiple myeloma. So it's not like breast cancer where you have the BRCA mutations and you know that this happens. We're still working on that. In fact, the PROMISE study is the first study that we look for family members of people who have myeloma or MGUS to see if they're at risk, if they have a higher incidence, and what is that genetic connection between them so that we can understand it better. And until then, we do not advocate to screen family members, but we would advocate that you go on the PROMISE study and be part of it. Dr. Gobriel is the principal investigator of the PROMISE study, the biggest myeloma screening study ever run to help prevent the blood cancer from occurring by catching it at an early stage. The PROMISE study is supported by a $10 million stand-up to cancer award. The study will screen the family members of patients over the age of 45 who have MGUS, smoldering myeloma, multiple myeloma, or Waldenstrom's. It will also screen the family members of African-American patients who are three times as likely to develop multiple myeloma. Joining the study is easy. Once you filled in your health tree profile, you can see a list of all the clinical trials you are eligible for in the current trials bucket. After you've selected the PROMISE study, click Contact Center at the bottom of the page and visit the PROMISE study website to register for the trial. You can also call the Spark Cures number if you need some help. They'd be happy to assist you. You'll be mailed a kit which you can take to a lab and the lab takes care of sending the samples to the researchers. What can we learn from a study of 50,000 people who are likely to be at risk for early myeloma conditions and their family members? Perhaps how to cure myeloma before it begins. Join this important study today.